All right, hi my magical creatures and welcome back to my channel. So today's pick a card reading is basically a daily message um, that you need to hear right now. Um, so this is gonna be pile number one, which is the clear quartz crystal. This is pile number two, which is a smoky quartz crystal. And then pile number three will have a, a blue topaz crystal. So let's pause the video and just sense which pile is for you and let's get started. Okay, so for the people that picked pile number one, which is the clear quartz, I'm going to go ahead and start. Okay, oh my goodness. So, okay, so for pile number one, um, so the card is Courage. So basically, um, Archangel Ariel, be courageous and stand up for your beliefs. And then what we have here is the Six of Swords. Um, so this, this card already shows that what you're, what you've been going through is you, it's been a time of, uh, sacred spe space for you. Um, what I'm seeing is that you need to be alone right now. Um, you need to stand up for yourself and, um, be courageous. And, um, with Archangel Ariel, I'm getting like a lioness energy, lion energy. So if you see lions around you, um, that means that she's with you. Also to the six of swords shows that you see the family is like leaving. Um, it shows that, you know, you might have to leave, um, the situation that you're in, in order to be yourself and to stand up for yourself. And you see how they're just not putting up with it and they're leaving and they're cutting people off. They're going to a new direction that is a more positive situation for themselves. And just know that Archangel Ariel is with you to help guide you into a more positive space. Um, you be yourself and you be your authentic self. And just know that Archangel Ariel is with you and is helping you and guiding you. Um, also, I see like a whistle or something like that. Like, I don't know if it's like a dog whistle or like some type of whistle, but it's like, you're basically got to blow the whistle and just enough is enough. Um, and you're just going where the wind takes you kind of see like a tornado. Like I see you like just, uh, beeline to where you need to go and just head strong. Oh, okay. So the reason why I'm seeing like a whistle and a tornado is that, um, it's an air. So usually what air, uh, air is, is that, um, it's in the Zodiac sign, air signs are like known as intellectual and communicative. So you might be an air sign, like a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius that may be going through this. Um, also too, I'm seeing fire as well. So like an Aries, Sagittarius, and a Leo as well. Um, just keep moving forward and you keep being you and stand up for yourself and, you know, be yourself and you'll get more respect. Um, but basically that's what I'm seeing. All right. Stay strong. Group number one. All right. So for the people that picked pile number two, you got the smoky quartz. So let's see. Okay. So for group number two, I got Archangel Han Neil. Um, trust and follow your renewed passion in your love life and career. And then also I'm getting the Emperor card. So basically what I'm getting from these cards is that um, Archangel Han Neil wants you to be yourself and follow your passions and your heart desires. Um, we need to do that. Um, know that she has you has you at your best interest and that she wants you to keep continuing keep going the emperor card i'm getting kind of like a father figure or i'm getting like there's somebody in your life putting up like i see like a big wall it's like they're trying to stop you from doing what you want to do and it's like you have to listen to them or whatever um Argando henry Heniel wants you to push through that and break through that wall and to keep going and doing what you want to do. Um, call an Archangel Haniel if you need help doing that. Um, also too, um, 
you're gonna have to be I, i'm getting like a goat like i see like a, a a ram uh put busting through the wall you just have to be headstrong and you have to just take charge oh that is so crazy like look there's rams right here i didn't even notice that and like i was seeing a picture of a ram that's crazy um yeah even right here too so basically i feel like once you do what you want to do I feel like the person that's stopping you from doing what you want to do will end up respecting you and you will end up getting their respect because you are being headstrong and you're basically taking control of your life and not letting someone telling you what to do. Um, and that is what the message that I get. Um, stay strong, group number two. Um, I'm rooting for you. Alrighty, so for group number three, um, this is uh the, for people that pick the blue the blue topaz let's see what we got all right so for group number three wait so the cards is clear audience archangel zikiel notice the loving guidance you hear inside your mind or from other people and then on this side we have the ace of swords so what i'm getting with these cards is that archangel zikiel is telling you that um whatever goals that you're trying to complete, whatever, uh, whatever ideas that you have, um, know that, um, the divine is by your side and wants you to do what you want to do. Um, also the Ace of Swords shows, to me, it just shows like God giving you a sword with the crown of victory. And basically what I'm getting is that the idea or the projects that you're trying to do Know that the divine got your back 100% and that you will conquer and you will succeed and you will make it and you will flourish. Um, what I'm getting is that um, this may be for air signs. I'm seeing like a whistle and a tornado. So basically you need to be headstrong. Um, so like for Libras, Geminis and Aquarius people. Um, also too, I'm also getting, I see water. Not so much water, but air. But I do see some water signs too, which is Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. So I'm basically what I'm seeing too. I see like a picture of a ram, and then I see like a river, and I just see like the ram is just being headstrong, and you're gonna there's gonna be some hurdles and some leaps that you're gonna have to get across in order to you know complete your goals. But it's definitely doable. You have the divine on your side. Um, also, to listen to the, the loving thoughts that you get, because most of the time it's usually your angels and guides talking to you and stuff, and um, they want you to win and they want you to succeed. And then I'll, also, I'm getting like a frog. Um, I don't know necessarily what the frog means, but I'm definitely, I feel like you have a frog animal totem spirit guide with you, so you might may want to look that up. So stay strong, group number three. Um, you definitely have God and the divine angels on your side to complete what you want to do. All right. I love you, um, my magical creatures. Definitely don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay magical.